one of those common places, uh, and certainly where my leaks have been, has been right here at the front of the door at the A pillar. And um, what I'll typically see is water come down in here and get to this little piece of foam. And that'll kind of get saturated very, very quickly. And then from there, it'll drip down onto the to the door top and fall down. And you know, I've I've heard of some folks that that just have their uh, entire floor pan full of water. So let me show you the solution that uh, I've come up with. And if you're like me, you're going to be kicking yourself when you see absolutely how simple this is. So let's take a look. So this is the solution I found: MD foam window seal. Air sealing tape, they call it. This is a, um, a Lowe's product. I'm sure Home Depot and other stores would have uh, similar products. But it's just it's very simple. If I can get it on camera. It's very simple foam. It's, um, I don't know how hard things are to do one handed, guys. <laughs> All right. Uh, it's got adhesive only on one side. The side I'm touching here is, uh, is just foam. The adhesive's on that side. So you'll peel it off, and I'll show you exactly where to put it. And believe it or not, this simple little $2.42 product, plus whatever tax is in your area, uh, have absolutely stopped. This has absolutely stopped all of my leaks. So here we are above my Jeep. I've got the Sunrider peeled back. And um, I got this idea from watching... Um, honestly, I was looking at replacement tops because I was getting so frustrated with the leaf. And I got to looking at um, the installation process for a couple of best top tops and noticed them putting foam in this area on both sides of the top, as well as where'd it go? I can't see my, my camera here. There we go, as well as that little strip in the middle. And that strip's probably um, and watching those refreshed my memory that I had had just the remnants of some adhesive here when I bought the Jeep. And I thought, okay, something had been there at one point in time. Well, ta-da, come to find out, okay, yeah, there's a factory seal that should have been here when I bought the Jeep. And uh, so I actually looked up, and the Mopar part was about 12 bucks. Well, like I said, this foam, an entire roll to do this many, many times was $2.00. And the Mopar part, imagine that, is many, many times more. So just simply putting this on right here at the edge of the, the plastic toward the header, down around, uh, doing this on both sides, and then probably about four or five inches across the center, um, you can kind of see this has been closed up for a while now. Um, but you can see where it's pressed into the rubber channel. Sorry for that little camera flip around. But it presses in right here, and just that little bit is all it takes to stop that leak. And it has worked well for me. We drove to Dallas in the midst of um, some pretty tremendous downpours the other day. And uh, had plenty of towels with us just in case. And let me tell you, uh, we were absolutely stunned. Not a drop came through and made its way inside. So that's all it is, guys. It's a very simple process. Um, nothing to it. So, good luck.